It's Brad and Kickstart PPC, and today I'm going to be going into the negative word rule on Scale Insights. Now, you've probably already seen my blacklist and whitelist rule videos, and those are very much more at targeting a product and applying the same keywords across the board. This, on the other hand, is going to be a lot more campaign specific. So you'll be able to set a certain campaign to have certain negative keywords, and you'll be able to automate that. So that's what I'm going to show you today, and let's jump straight into the video. Now, all you need to do is go into your Scale Insights dashboard, go automation and negative word rule, and you'll be at this page here. So you'll have uh, all your assigned rules in this section, negative word rules, and this will show you all of the different rules that you've created. So for example, this is the demo account. So this is uh, greater than 25 clicks, no orders, make that a negative keyword. So you can go through here and apply anything that you already have or anything that's set up as default if you want to, but then you go into create a rule and you can set the criteria. So you go ahead, create a criteria profile. Just go in here, create one, say it's 30 clicks, no sales. And then you go create. See, so add a name as well. And you'll then have uh, this criteria profile to set up. So you just go uh, add that in. You can do ASIN search terms, campaign, ad group, or custom group. So wherever those search terms are coming from, um, you can get that set up. You can then go um, add to blacklist. So this really helps if you have um, an auto campaign and you've got certain criteria. You're just trying to filter as many of those irrelevant search terms as possible to the blacklist. You can do that here. Your whitelist as well, uh, typically that will be for anything that you don't want negatived. You can have this ignore the whitelist if that's what you want to do. You have that option. So all you need to do is just go ahead and you know write test and then just go ahead and press create and you're good to go. It's as simple as that. So all you need to do, get that criteria profile made, make it your specification, get that all set up, link it to your campaigns and you should be up and running. It's quite easy. And, you know, in the case that you want to look at things in a more manual way, we also recommend this as well, because say you have uh, the word bottle gets negative phrase matched, then that could potentially cause this whole listing to have problems, being it's an infuser bottle. So you want to have a degree of uh, monitoring of what you're doing on the account, and what negatives you're adding. So that's why, especially with the negative, uh, negative blacklist and whitelist rules you want to be very careful on what you're putting in make sure that your good search terms are in the whitelist rule we have a video on that as well so you can check that out it's on our channel and with that you can make sure that you have the best strategy in place that you can have so in the case that you want to get more scale insights videos definitely subscribe to the channel we're making a ton of scale insights videos going into all of the features everything you need to know and in the case that you need help with your Amazon PPC, our details are in the description. You can contact me, contact me directly. My email's down there. So I'll be the one responding to your emails. We can chat and see, see if we can help you out. And in the case that you do not have Scale Insights and you're looking to sign up, we have a 10% off lifetime discount coupon code with a 30-day free trial without need for a credit card to sign up. So... You can easily test out this software, see if it's right for you. We think it will be. We use it for a lot of our clients and it works very well. And in the case that you've got some questions, leave a comment below. I'm answering personally to any questions and queries that you have. So feel free and reach out. Let us know what you think. And until the next video, hope you guys have a good day and we'll see you then. Bye.